If I asked you to draw these three objects, how would you make the avocado look close to you and the garlic look far away? There are four ways to create the illusion of depth in your artwork. The first one is placement. When you place an object closer to the bottom of the page, it usually looks closer. And when you place it higher on the page, closer to the horizon line, it usually looks farther away. The next one is size. Objects that are drawn closer usually are drawn bigger, and objects that are drawn smaller usually look farther away. The next one is overlap. If you notice here, the apple is covering a little bit of the garlic, and that overlap makes the apple look closer. The last one is detail. Objects that are closer usually have more detail, and objects that are farther away usually have less detail. That's also called atmosphere. You can use all four of these to create a realistic sense of depth in your drawings. Once you've shown me which object is closest to you and which one is farthest away, I want you to use value to make those objects look three-dimensional. Value is just the arty way of saying light and dark. We're going to use colored pencils, so start by drawing the darkest darks first. You'll see that I used a black sharpie to draw the deep dark shadows under each object. Then I used a black colored pencil to show the darker shaded portions of the objects. Then I add color. That color will be our middle value. I was careful to leave at least one white highlight on each object. That white spot is our whitest white. Those three values work together to make your objects look three-dimensional.